yeah, I was requested to do this game, and yeah, I mean, a number of people requested it, but I'm just gonna. I figured it's a, it's a fun game. It, it's not doesn't make a very good let's play actually, and this is gonna be a walkthrough. But I just had the urge to make some footage of it. I want to make a new user just because uh, it tends to work out better that way. So start adventure. <laughs> Other character? Probably not. I really hope not, because I had a long, long, high score and whatnot. Plants versus zombies. This is just a fun game. Templar's house. I has no grass. Oh no! Give me a little. Oh, thank you, thank God. A little bit of grass. Yes. Click on a seed packet. Boink. Ooh, it's a uh, sun. We need to collect sun. Boink. Don't let the zombies reach your house. They're coming. They're coming. <laughs> do, do, do. So yeah, your goal is to keep the zombies from getting across the lawn. It's a basically a tower defense game. And if they do, you do have your lawnmowers, which can give you a one-time drill through everything. Brains. Brains. Final wave! Whenever, see right here, whenever there's a final wave, there's more mobs that cause, get, attack you at that point. So, I mean, this is, of course, the really easy level. It's just a tutorial. And I have a new plant. Doom and Bloom Seed Company. The sunflower gives you additional sun. Very useful. Ooh, look at all those zombies. So it, whenever it does that one thing where it shows you the zombies, it gives you an idea of um, what is coming to attack you. So if there, as you saw, there was only regular zombies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now I even get uh, sunlight from my sunflowers, as well as from the sun. And they're just bobbing their head, doing the thing. Oh yeah. And it takes a while for uh, plants to recharge. The uh oh. The zombies are coming. So I need to put down a sunflower, right? Right, yeah, to get... Wait, wait, no. That doesn't seem like that's going to get rid of them. I'll get rid of them. Will he beat him before he starts destroying my plants? Uh oh. Another one's coming. Whatever shall I do? So yeah, I play this game quite a bit. It's a fun game. I just... Yeah, I didn't feel like doing a let's play of it at the time, and, and now it's a walkthrough. But uh, I think it... Anyone that's interested in it will be interested in it. Anyone else... Well, you don't have to watch it if you don't want. Brains. Brains. It doesn't have to be symmetrical or anything. Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't have a, to a d I don't have a shovel. I forgot. I can't actually get rid of things. Oh, this is a problem, actually. That might be able to do it. Yeah, that worked. Huge wave of zombies is approaching. I don't want to put any more sunflowers. That's not going to help me any. No, oh, that was just about perfect. Most of the guys are on the top and bottom of rows, and I got three on each of those to start out with. Ooh, the ever famous cherry bomb. Nice. Blows up all zombies in an area. Awesome. Ah, now we've got guys with cones on their heads. They are twice as strong. 
So the, you try to go fast. The faster you move, the better you do. And it's very convenient if you can get two, uh, a 25 and a 25 before it's ready to set down again. If you're waiting for it and you don't have enough stuff, like right now, it's annoying and random. There's a couple different things I could do. I could use a pea shooter at this point, or I could use a cherry bomb, but cherry bombs are kind of expensive, so I'll probably just use a pea shooter. Put it right there, I think that'll be good. If you go too far forward, then he will just eat it before it will be destroyed. But I think that's going to be good. Uh-oh. Ah, there we go. Yep, I'm, I'm going risky. I'm going for the sun, not going for the building defense. Thanks. Of course, the more of these guys you have, the more you resources you collect. So the better you do. can't believe I have all these guys and I still don't have enough sun for this. There we go. Keep that up. Put that one up there. Still don't have a shovel. In the in, later in the game, you get a shovel in which to drop things down. I might use a cherry bomb because I'm basically set for how much stuff I I need. Except I don't have very much don't have very much sun yet. And these guys are gonna be easy to kill. Here we go. Uh, I'm gonna wait and see if there's another one because it'd be nice to kill more than one enemy with this. But that doesn't seem like that's gonna happen. Nope. Alright. So let's just put it right here. Oh yeah! The sun will disappear after a bit, so you wanna try and pick it up. With two shooters, I think I'll be fine there. Could be wrong. We'll find out. Yep. Once they have no head, they can't chew on anything. That's always convenient. Now I'm just kind of collecting resources. As you can see, the cherry bomb takes a long time to recharge, but that's why they have multiple different kinds of bombs. Am I even recording my voice? Yeah, I am. comes a huge wave of zombies! And I'm gonna have just my cherry bombs right there ready. Walnut! Blocks off zombies and protects your other plants. Very useful if you end up putting something way too far forward and it starts getting destroyed. Um, or you're worried about getting destroyed, you just throw it on a walnut really quick and you're doing much better. Same zombies as last time, but maybe we have five spots now. Yep, we've got five spots, five things tall. So hopefully there'll be one normal sun and one drop from him. Come on, drop, 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 drop. Darn it! Come on! Come on! See, this is... While that happens, everything goes slower then. So it can actually really add up. Whenever you have it where you can't put down a sunflower when you want to, it adds up and it makes everything else go slower. Yeah, I'll show you how the walnut works. Brains. Chewing away at my walnut. But while he's chewing at it, on it, he can't really do much. But I'm not really killing him either. So we should put something like this right here. Come on, son. I can only put it that far forward because I have the wants there. Now in this situation, I don't think I really can. I'm going to put it back away.
So here, I can put one right there. Oh! See, here's a problem now. I got guys coming from two different locations that are undefended. So, I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to do about that. I think I'm going to have to save up for a cherry bomb, because I don't know of any other... Well, wait, I can do this. And of course, if one of your walnuts gets destroyed, you can always put down another one. It's a really good way of getting them to slow down. Get some more of these guys. Let's put this guy up here. And put this guy up there. And put him there, since he's already in front of that. Except I don't have a walnut to put down, so that's kind of a problem. Because he'll get destroyed. Oh, no, actually, there's two guys there, so that might not actually happen. He's getting lots of sun at this point. A cherry bomb works in a plus sign, essentially. Aha! A huge wave is approaching. Cool. Could use another walnut. There we go. Boink and boink. Look at how much sun I'm getting. Oh yeah! Let's put another one here. Owned. I'm making this look easy, but because I've played it a lot. Oh, the shovel! Yay! I needed that shovel! Shovel, shovel, shovel! 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 That's gonna help a lot. Blabby wow. Greetings, neighbor! I love this guy. This guy's awesome. Blabby blabby. My name's Crazy Dave. But you can just call me Crazy Dave. Listen, I've got a surprise for you. But I need you to clear your lawn. Use your shovel to dig up those plants. Let the digging commence! Oops. Okay, good enough for the surprise. We're going bowling! Here, take this walnut. Why did I put a walnut in your hand? Because I'm crazy! Now, go! Bowl me a winner! I has a walnut. So, this is a mini game. As if this entire game wasn't a mini game. And these walnuts you can use to smack into enemies. There's an explodo nut, too. Those are much more damaging. They're just like the cherry bombs. Uh, walnuts do one damage, I think, to enemies. So these guys have, quote unquote, two hit points. So I'm kind of le letting these pile up. And um, I think it would be better to use an explodo nut instead of four walnuts to kill this. So, go like that. Oops. <laughs> he got too far away from the other one. So I gotta go one. Also, it bounces around and sometimes will hit other such zombies. You're just trying to keep it from getting to over here, so you can just let these things pile up. Mm -hmm. But you don't want to get too far because it'll go to the point where you can't uh, 